So what is the chemistry that brings five people together like yourselves? To the love of music. Yeah. Yeah. The love of playing other. together, love of performing. <coughs> we've, we've been with each other now, Charlie and I have been together for four years. Right. And he just walked up to me in the halls of the Berkeley School of Music and said, I'm, I'm trying to get my flute together and can I come and sit in with you for no pay, you know. Right. He played with us for quite a bit and then and Dave and Mike joined up with us. And then when we came down to Florida, Gary followed, I guess, about a year after we got down. Yeah. And Gary's been with us, you know, all moving together as this particular group for years. two years now. Yeah. What type of people have influenced you? Or have you been influenced at all? Well, that varies so much. Yeah. So, yeah. Like, yeah. Like, yeah. Our, yeah. our backgrounds <laughs> are incredibly different. Right. And that's what makes the band. Uh, that's one of the things that really adds up to what we have. Especially since it meshes so well, you know. Right. A lot of times you can't do that. So. Yeah, I was brought up in... Uh, like in a show band kind of situation where we played, say, the Kings Inn and Freeport right. and uh, the Fountain Blue here in Miami, yeah. and just around like that. And, and that was my background, and I brought that to the group. Gary had his studio experience, and mm -hmm. you know, I started out in the strip club when I was 15 years old. <laughs> That's good. Nobody ever came in here. Well, there's a chance to play, but nobody ever came in here to the music. They were right. working. Yeah. The ladies. Uh, now, David, what type of musical? I started out in basically at first in Dixieland and then in black music, rhythm and blues, blues. And how about you, Michael? I grew up playing 40s music and big band jazz. That's what I really enjoy. With your feelings about managers and agents as it is now, you don't use them, how are you going to be able to relate to that end of it when you finally have to go into it on the recording level and you finally have to go in the whole way, but not at all? I think we're going to have to find somebody who believes in what we're doing and in the band as much as we do and doesn't want to be someone that the band hires. Right. But somebody who really wants to become a part of what we're trying to do and okay. believes in what we're trying to say. It's like a family, like Gary's married and also Dave's married. Mm -hmm. And Missy and Joanne, they come in and they give their ideas and we want their ideas because it is a family kind of organization. Do you watch on the road with you? Occasionally Sometimes when we have do. good accommodations. And we're living in tents. <laughs> <laughs> That's really important the to get tent. their viewpoint of the band because right. they see us out in the audience where I would like to be watching because that's yeah. where you learn yeah. what you can yeah. spot some things that we do. That right. So they contribute in. ideas to the band also. Right. Oh, for sure. And uh, we need someone in a management kind of role that will be part of the family, you know, want to work for the, the whole group and will be part of them too. So that person has not come along yet, then I take it. We've well, met huh? some really fine people recently. <laughs> for sure. Yeah. Recently, yeah. a lot of things have fallen into it a lap and we're giving serious thought right but we're just kind of moving very slowly and listening and trying to do the right thing for the group do you want to get into doing the album yes mm -hmm. yeah we really would we want to do a, a really fine album you know we really want to put a lot of time into it right and take these tunes that we've, we've worked on these tunes for quite a while some of them are new right and uh we've had some around for a long time it's how hard is it to get a recording contract today well, it's easy to get a recording contract, getting a good one. <laughs> you can get one where you can sign away everything you own and right. everything else, and the record company still asks you for more. But then right. we're looking for a, not only a, a lucrative contract, but we're looking for one that gives us a lot of artistic freedom, which for an unknown group is a, is a big load yeah. to ask. Right. And I think it's going to take a little time, but we all feel that we'll find it. We all feel that there's something oh. out there that will take us.